Hello everybody, it's Andrea, welcome back to the channel. I'm finally going to do my completed pages for you. I coloured, I think, 27 pages this month, which is really good for me. Um, a lot of patterns, I did at least one in each of my 10 books to finish. Some of them I did more than one. I didn't do the 18 I needed to do per month to do it, but that's fine. Um, I know I'm not going to do them all. So, the first page I've got to show you is from Hannah Lynn's new book, Fierce and Fancy Fantasy Faces. Try saying that after you've had a few. And I did this cake lady. The lady with the tea cake, with little cakes in her hair. I, I haven't done backgrounds. I just can't be bothered with backgrounds at the moment, so. But yeah, I enjoyed that one. I think, I think this is a lovely book. I'm going to enjoy colouring in this book. I, I'm, uh, I love Hannah Lynn. That little vampire's cute, so. This was just done with um, Windsor and Newton markers and maybe one oh hoo hoo but mostly Windsor and Newton markers oh and the um, the one Copic I've got for the skin so that's that one then I did one in Colour in Heaven's Steampunk Animals special and I'm not big on animals or steampunk so I did the one that had very little animal in it it's got a few butterflies and that's about it. I apologise for this. This is the strap on my camera just hanging down over the page. Um, so this was this Butterfly by Christine Caron. And I used the Black Widows on this one. And for the butterflies, the Metallic Brute Funus. I really like it. It's really nice. It's a really nice picture. I'll try and get that away. So yeah, it didn't take long, but I enjoyed doing it. So that's good. Another Colour in Heaven book I did was one in Strawberry Shortcake. I love Strawberry Shortcake. I remember this from when I was a kid. I had a Strawberry Shortcake doll. My brother hated it because he hated the smell. And I did this one. And this was a buddy colour with Molly Newland. Hello, Molly. And this one was done using, again, the Copic for the skin. But the rest of it is done other than the... No, I think the background was as well, was done with Windsor and Newton markers because I really like those markers and I don't use them that often. I really like the path. I think the path looks really nice. But I really enjoyed this one. I did one in Moon Valley by Maria Trollet. Again, I've got so many books. I'm trying to colour in them all one at a time and trying not to buy as many. So I did this one with the tulips and the moth. And this was done with the Artworks pencils. They are so, so soft. It is unbelievable. They kept falling apart, literally. They keep crumbling. They were some prisoners for it. But they look really nice and they went down quite nicely on, on the paper. And I, I enjoyed colouring this one. one from Colour My Horde 2023 Forest Animals by Jade Summer. Again I'm not big on animals. I don't even know why I bought this book but it's it's you know they're kind of cute. I did the first page and again this was done with the artworks pencils and the, those pencils don't work too badly on the Jade Summer paper which is the Amazon paper. I, I quite like it. I think it's really pretty. I enjoyed I she enjoyed colouring it and I don't normally enjoy colouring with pencils in this book but uh, I did this one. I did finish the Alice in Wonderland picture that I started with way back before Christmas. I just wanted to get it out of the way, get it put away, so I just finished it off again with the Oh Hoo Hoo's uh, pastels. She looks quite pretty. She's quite pretty. One that was a holdover from Christmas is one from Gingerbread Life. Uh, colouring book cafe again this was a colour your hoard one and i finished it finally in january i can't believe it january's already gone and again this was used various markers um oh who who's um i don't know there's a piece of paper in there so is it yeah um oh i got yes i didn't put a blot of page in so it went through but i'm not too worried about that um that's just me forgetting uh, there's a bit of um, something on there to make snow. I can't remember what it is. It's um, Winker Stella. Mostly it's the oh hoo hoos the pastels. And so on. I've missed a bit of blue up there. I'll have to fill that in later. There's that one. Put that to one side so I can fill that bit in later. And then uh, relax with our issue 99. I 
did this one at the beginning of the month this is the the sugar skull and I just did it with my various clear gel pens I've got so many I just went let's just use them see what we got there's that um, coloring book cafes I kind of said coloring book cafes 125 mandala coloring book now as you know I do these books in order so it'll be the first one and I did this with the Pastelo pencils I thought I'll use pencils for a change I always almost always do these patterns with pens with glitter pens or markers or fine liners but I thought I'll do one with pencils and I quite enjoyed it as well so I love the purple that purple color is absolutely lovely now we're on to the colour by number books before we hit the 10 books I want to finish this year and we'll do those separately I did a couple in desserts uh, ceramic tiles by Prachi De One Such Diva so I did this one and these were done with the Amazon pens I think yeah the Amazon pens and I did this one I like the Amazon pens, they're really nice. They just sit downstairs on the coffee table and if I colour a book like this, out they come and off I go. I did one in Magical Artifacts by uh, Sachin Sachdeva. Uh, it was just the one, wasn't it? Yeah, I just I did this one of the uh, Mushroom House. I think it's so cute. And again, this is the Amazon pens. So I do put something in between because these Amazon pens they will go through so uh, do put something in between your pages but i really like them i think they're lovely pens that was that one and before we hit uh the 10 books to finish i did a couple i did quite a few actually in sun life drawings 100 best adult color by numbers i like this book again i just sit there with a load of markers and chill using the Ohuhu water brush ones I've been using on this one so I did the turtle and like the, the hedgehog or porcupine whatever it is I'm not actually sure and um, I did the sun one I like this one I like I like this sort that's so pretty again this is what I with the Amazon pens and a gold uh, and gold and a silver Pen. I can't think of what it's called, a glitter pen. Uh, again, this is the Amazon pens. And that's the last one I done. I'm looking forward to doing the next one. So quite a few in that book. So I do like doing this book. Right. Right, let me find my marker pen because I haven't marked them off in my colouring journal, which is here. So I'm going to mark them off as we go through them. So the first book we have is Witch Fantasy. I'll show you which one I did there in a second. Let me just show you that one. So I did this one. Again, this was done with the I want to say Amazon pens looking at them because they're just handy to have around. So I did that one. That now leaves me with two, four, six, nine. So I will finish this one around October, I would imagine. Let's put that to one side. Then I did another one in Stained Glass Egyptian Designs. This one's my favourite book. This one I'm going to finish around June and I did the one of Isis. I'll just make a note on my book that I have done it. I just put a cross in it for now and I'll fill it in afterwards. And again, this was done with the Amazon markers because I'm trying to use them and see what I like. And I do like them. But there's only like five left in there now. There's not many in that one at all. Uh, I did one in Creative Haven's Rose Windows. And that leaves me with 15 in this one. And I did that one. It's very pretty. Again, this was done using the Crelando markers. I always use those ones in here. They're just so bright and lovely. Um, yeah. Hopefully I'll do a couple of these uh, this month, I think. Next is Easy Flower Mandalas by Stefania Miro. 
again I did one and that leaves me with 15 and I did this one and that was just done with my glitter gel pen sometimes I just want to gel pen it other times I don't but you know what it's like sometimes you just want to use gel pens and other times you want to use markers or pencils uh, but yeah that's that one Colour by number, Jade Summer Mandalas. How many did I do in here? Let's have a look. I love this book. Oops, that's what I'm doing. That's what I've done. Is it just that one? I haven't put any marker in. No, I did two. So I did this one. This has been done using various alcohol markers. So because I've got quite a lot of markers downstairs, I've got... Um, Oh gosh, what's it called? I've got some Ohoohoos, I've got Deco Time, I've got Bold Mirror, and I've also got some Shuttle Art ones. So they were sort of a mixture of all of them. I pick which colour I want. And the same with that one. And I have started another one. You see some of the colours are running out now. And that one leaves me with 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. So this is one of the ones I know I'm not going to finish this year, but I'm going to have a, a good go at it. Uh, colour by number flowers again Jade Summer I only did the one in this one by the look of it oh no two I did do two that's good if I can do two every month and I did this one again same sort of thing same um, markers I used it's always going to be that unless I state otherwise it's going to be a mixture and this one that's quite nice I did those and that leaves me with 18 in that book then we have kawaii color by numbers by color questopia oh, I love this book I do I love doing this book it's one of my favorite books and I did this one as the little cacti and again this was using the Amazon pit pens in this book because they go through slightly so and I'm and this is when I found out that they went through so now I make sure I put a bit of paper behind them when I'm, I'm doing those and I did this one as well it's so cute um but I really like this book I'm just marking them off um so yeah, as you can see here, that's come through. I don't know if you can actually, if I could just pull it up a bit for you to see, hang on. Uh, yeah, there is bits where it's come through because I didn't put the color behind it, the paper behind it. Um, again, Amazon markers. So I do love this little book though. It is so cute. I do get a bit fed up doing the outlines. I'm not gonna lie. I can see a bit I missed and I'll fix it later when I come back to the book. That one will leave me with 5, 10, 15, 20, 22. Then I've got Chelsea's Pretty Creations. This is a very slim book. I only did one in here. And that will leave me with nine. So I only got to do one a month and I'm done. I think it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, yeah. Um, and I did this one. I think it's so cute. I think these are a cute little book, so that one get that one out for a minute and then we've got 50 easy patterns by Jade Summer and I did this one with my glitter gel pens as you can see there's some difference in coloring in the green they change color this is because I was just trying to use up some of my odd pieces of uh, ink just to try and get rid of a few I know I haven't shown you which ones how many pens I've used I used up tons of pens I always forget so I do apologize um, so is it just that one in there yeah so that leaves me with 5 10 15 20, 20, 30 34 so again this is one of the books I'm not expecting to finish this year but I want to make a good dent on it and the last one is 50 Easy Mandalas by Jade Summer. Again, I've only done the one in here. So let me just put across there. So I'll fill that in later. And I did this one. This was using, I think this was using the Deco Time markers, to be honest. I think, looking at it, yeah. Um, just some random ones. I might do one uh, of each colour pack actually just to, to see like one mandala for each colour pack so 
for that just to see what happens but yeah it's all right quite like it. it looks better on camera than it does in real life to be fair so those are all the 27 I think it was 27 or so pages I coloured in the month of January um strawberry shortcake is my favorite I'm not gonna lie I love that picture just because it brings back so many memories and on to February I mean it's, it's getting on I think it's a six today and I haven't coloured a, I haven't finished a single page I've got some on the go I hope you've enjoyed this video. I will be back soon with my book haul, which is huge, and my reading completed books, which isn't so big, but uh, just having the time to do it because I've got lots of things going on. So I will see you in the next video, guys. Bye.